Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Or if you're new here, hi, welcome. My name is Rania and today I'm so excited. Uh, but I hide my address, but uh, I ordered the Hourglass, their new holiday uh, quad. What is it? The Ghost Quad for holiday 2019. I actually ordered it yesterday, the day that it launched on their website, which was September 17th. And I just got it like a day later. Anyways, I'm so excited. I haven't opened the box yet. I haven't looked at the palette. I figured, you know what? Let's just open the box together. I'll do some swatches and I'll show you what it looks like in real life. Uh, so... Um, the same packaging that I always get when I order from our glass, direct, our glass directly. I don't know if this uh, specific palette is gonna be at Sephora. Um, for some reason, I thought it was just exclusive to our glass. I could be wrong, but um, here it is. I'm ready for fall. I'm ready for holidays. Got my fall sweater on. Got my dark eyeshadow. My lipstick. This is going to put me in the mood for holidays. Um, usually when I order from Hourglass, they do send a little sample of their Veil Mineral Primer. Actually, it's the primer I use today. I do really like it. I don't have it in full size. I just use the little samples. And looks like they also send uh, ooh, some uh, foundation samples. That's new. They didn't send that last time I ordered from them. And here is the palette. Uh, it's four... Uh, blushes. I think three of them are new shades. One of them is a shade that already exists in their in their line. And if you don't know, our glass is cruelty free, and they call themselves a luxury brand. Uh, yeah, I would say. Um, I, I I love the the little logo that they have. I know on, online on like the Instagram pictures or even on their website, the packaging looked kind of pretty crappy. So I was a little bummed about that, but it's okay. It is what it is. Um, total amount that you get in here is 1.4 grams per blush. Um, kind of curious to figure out the many sizes of their blushes. How many grams are they? Let's go ahead and look that up real quick. Okay, so I just looked it up on Sephora's website and usually their mini blushes are 1.3 grams and they retail for $24. So getting 1.4 grams each, uh, four of those, I, I believe it was $58 when I ordered it. So I think that's a pretty good deal. That's kind of like getting two and a half blush, like paying for two and a half mini size blushes and getting four. Um, so here's what it looks like. Again, it does have that plasticky back, kind of looks a little cheap, but the, ah, but the front is their typical, um, like the typical hourglass packaging. And there it is. That's what it looks like so pretty um, I do like that they have the numbers on the back one two three they call each one of them one two three and four and then they do have the names of them uh, on the back so this would be the first one is a uh, surreal effect this is a straw blush and this is in the shade brilliant nude this is a straw blush in the shade is lucid glow and this is just a regular blush in the shade infinite flush let's go ahead and do swatches um, I can that plastic packaging. I wish they did their typical holiday packaging. They usually do like the, you know, like their usual packaging for holiday palettes, but I don't know. I don't know the reason that they did this specific packaging. Maybe it's, I mean, I still think their six pan palette, they, they are still charging $80 for it. So I don't know. Um, it's not like they reduced the price or anything like that. And here we are. I'm just going to do double swatches because I do have um, quite a bit of tan going on right now. And I want the colors to show up. Uh, I would say three of them would be um, definitely blushes for me. One of them I'll probably be using as a highlight. But here's what they look like. Um, the first one over here is the Surreal Effect. The second one is Brilliant Nude. The third one is Lucid Glow. And then the last one is Infinite Flush. Again, I do have a little bit of tan. So 
I would say if you are light medium skin tone these will probably be good for you but if it's a deep skin tone unfortunately I don't think that these will work on you and that is one thing that is disappointing with hourglass I think it's about time that they create a palette that pretty much everyone can use or make two new palettes I mean make two palettes why just stick to the one palette um, it, it, it's that time that they should have um, palettes for someone for people of color or someone with a deeper skin tone here's what the swatches look like on my hand uh, I do I don't know if the formula is a little bit different but it did look or it did feel a little bit powdery in the pan over here like I can see some of the powder which usually I don't get that with their with their regular blushes but I don't know maybe using with a brush it would be a little bit different anyways first impressions I'm really excited I do really like the colors uh, probably the only one that wouldn't work for me as a highlight is the second one right here or as a blush would be the second one and then the other three I think they'll be okay for me as a highlight on my skin tone I don't think I have anything else to add to this I don't know if I'll be picking up their six pan palette um, maybe I'll wait until it comes to Sephora and I'll pick it up during the VIB sale in November for now I'm pretty happy just having the one palette from their holiday collection $58 I don't think it's a bad deal I do really like their blushes I wonder um, you probably can swirl your brush in all of them together get one shade let's see what that would look like okay so that it that's it right there it looks really pretty it looks very natural um, their strobe blush they don't look to be too stroby swatch on my hand but who knows maybe on the face they'll be like bam in your face I doubt it all of their products are pretty subtle if you guys have any questions any comments or anything like that please go ahead and leave them in the comment section below please give this video a like if you enjoyed it um, or if you'd like to see more holiday videos I do have a couple more coming up and please don't subs don't forget to subscribe please subscribe before you leave and I'll see you guys in the next one bye